As the holiday weekend starts, tragedy struck on the roads around one Friday afternoon. Austin Travis County EMS says there was a crash between two vehicles at State Highway 130 and Highway 183. One person died on scene and two were taken to the hospital, one with life-threatening injuries. While the cause hasn't been released yet, state agencies are reminding Texans to be safe on the roads this holiday season, especially with wet weather on the way. Roads may be slick and don't try to drive through flooded streets. The Texas Department of Emergency Management says crews are on standby for severe weather response. The Department of Public Safety is starting its annual holiday traffic enforcement campaign through January 1st. More troopers will be out looking for drivers who are speeding, not wearing seat belts, or driving under the influence. We want everyone to have a safe and joyful holiday season, so be sure to buckle up and avoid distractions behind the wheel and make sure Safety is your number one priority. TxDOT says last December, more than 100 people were killed and more than 220 injured in alcohol-related crashes across the state. 22-year-old Case Clark was killed by a drunk driver in 2021 in the Lubbock area. There isn't a day that goes by that we don't remember our sweet boy and all of the good that he did in this world and the potential that he had to do in this world but was robbed from us because of the senseless act of this one person choosing to drive under the influence. TxDOT's drunk driving prevention campaign runs through New Year's Day. If you've had any amount of alcohol, don't get behind the wheel. Alcohol related crashes can cause life altering, disabling and permanent injuries for survivors, and they can be deadly. A DWI can cost up to $17,000 in fines and fees and lead to jail time, loss of a driver's license, difficulty finding or keeping a job, loss of trust from loved ones, and a lifetime of regret.